Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to customize uh, the headers inside a blog post, a WordPress uh, article on your WordPress uh, website. So the headers here being tidy garden, tidy kitchen, tidy bedrooms. We have 15 uh, different uh, sections in the article, each with a H3 header, and we want to customize them uh, simultaneously uh, all together via uh, CSS. The way we do this is first open uh, the customize uh, section inside of WordPress. Then we choose the additional CSS uh, panel. And as you can see, there are already a few CSS instructions uh, inside uh, of this uh, customizing uh, panel. And uh, we will add some instructions for the H3 headers. The first thing we do is declare H3. Uh, we don't need a dot, uh, dots uh, are only used for CSS classes. So if it's a header like h1, h2, h3, h4, h5, h6, you don't need a dot. Then you open and close the curly braces and all the uh, CSS instructions will be uh, inside of uh, those curly braces. We will start uh, with an instruction for the font weight font weight. I paste it from another tab and we will make it bolder. Uh, as you can see uh, my headers become a bit bolder. Then we will work on the background color. Background color and we want the same kind of green as we have here. Uh, I will copy paste the value, the hexadecimal value of my green right here. And I would like to have more space around the text, so I will add some padding. Padding. I can add maybe 20 pixel like that, everywhere. And I would like also more uh, space uh, between uh, the, the text of the previous section and uh, the header, and between the header and uh, the text uh, which uh, follows the header. So it's outside of the box, we will add some margin, not padding, but margin. Margin top 40 pixels, like that. And we will do the same for a margin under the header, 40 pixels, like this. So as you can see via those instructions that we have just added in the customizing panel, I have uh, customized all my headers, all my H3 headers inside uh, of my article. I still have, I think, an H2 header right here, uh, which uh, wasn't uh, affected by this rule because this rule only applies to H3 headers. You saw how easy it was to uh, customize your headers uh, via uh, custom CSS inside of WordPress. If you have any questions, just uh, uh, type them inside uh, the comment, uh, uh, the commenting section uh, below, and I will be happy to answer them as soon as possible. If you have any idea for another uh, WordPress uh, tutorial, either just for WordPress or for Elementor in WordPress, ACF, custom post types, uh, or any other plugin, you can uh, also uh, leave a comment and I will try to uh, record uh, this new tutorial as soon as possible.